Hi, I'm Eric Dibble, Regional Sales Manager at HF Scientific. In today's video, we will be going over the setup and installation of the HF Scientific CLX Online Chlorine Analyzer. When you receive your new CLX in the box, you will see the following items. The manual, the certificate of analysis, a flush kit, a tubing kit, which includes an extra cuvette, mounting brackets, and a T-strainer. We will begin by putting the T-strainer on the inlet quick connect to the analyzer, making sure to have the arrow pointing in the flow direction. Next, we will install our air gap drain. This is a very important step in the setup procedure. Air gapping the drain will allow us to have proper draining on the analyzer. Personally, I like to use a plastic funnel, but you can use PVC if you prefer. The key is to make sure nothing is touching the drain fitting and there is space to let the water freely flow out of the bottom of the analyzer. Next, we will wire the power side of the analyzer. We will start by removing the plastic cover and finding the green power connection. Next, we push our wiring through the cord grips. Make sure to wire the green wire to ground, white to neutral, and black to live. Push the green fitting back into place and tighten the core grip to make sure our wires won't get pulled. Once we power the analyzer on, we will give everything a good visual check before we turn the water on. Make sure the cuvette is properly seated in the optical block. Make sure the thumb screw on the reagent pump is twisted all the way down. We want to make sure the tubing on the reagent pump is good and snug. After a visual inspection, we will turn the water on and check for any leaks on the quarter inch tubing on the outside of the analyzer. We will install the reagents and perform a flow test, which can be found in our other videos called Monthly Reagent Change. Thank you for watching this video. If you have more questions, please refer to our other videos on the HF Scientific CLX or reach out to your local HF Scientific sales rep.